Back to the charts for Big Boss Crypto, and today we will once again take a look at Chainlink and huge breaking news regarding Chainlink powering all CBDCs. We will take a look at this white paper published history by the World Economic Forum regarding CBDCs and interoperability, and how Chainlink is the key in order to make interoperability work between all CBDCs through the power of Chainlink's CCIP protocol. So without further ado, let's look at the charts. All right then, so shout out to this guy called Sarge Major H. Barry on Twitter right here for basically sharing this information and basically pinpointing interesting segments regarding this article, which points out to being chain being the key behind CBC's interoperability and where the real value will be in the upcoming years. So as you can see right here, a big quote right here, as you can see that Oracles play a crucial role in interoperability between CBC's and external systems providing trust, real-time data on asset prices, exchange ratings, rates, etc. And that CBDC systems should incorporate robust and secure Oracle mechanisms that ensure the accuracy, reliability, and integrity of the information obtained from external systems. Now, if this doesn't scream Chainlink CCIP protocol, I don't know what does, because basically with the huge partnerships that Chainlink has, together with Swift, and not only that, the BIS, the Central Bank of Central Banks, uh, Banks of Inter International Settlements, also say that tokenization might be the next major leap for the monetary system. And they all basically agree that tokenization needs to happen, and the key to making it happen is Chainlink CCIP protocol. And if you're still not convinced, if we take a look at the technical side of the document, where if you want to read the report by yourself, I'll provide the link in the description. As you see right here, basically all of these technical uh, uh, segments basically corresponds perfectly to what Chainlink's mission is with their CCIP protocol and basically how their infrastructure works with intelligent compatibility, connectivity, messaging standardization, inter interoperable APIs, security and privacy, especially with uh, re uh, the new innovations in Deco that Chainlink has recently uh, done. Secure and trusted oracles, especially that part that's crucial, like the report says, in order to make interoperability work, and also testing and certification, where basically CBC systems should go undergo rigorous testing and certification, which currently CCP does as of recently, where Sergey Nazarov, the CEO of Chainlink, say, says that they're currently doing some serious testing, rigorous testing, in order to see that the protocol is truly, truly safe. Now, if you're still not convinced that uh, Chainlink will be the future in the upcoming years and will be the key behind tokenization and in order to make CBDCs work, being in order to regulate AI and much, much more, like this guy says on Twitter right here, ilink.ccip, follow the talent. And as you see right here, uh, rec recent uh, job experience publishments, as you see right here, there's a guy that was the former vice president of BlackRock, worked there for uh, almost four years, who has recently been hired by Chainlink Labs full time as a technical program manager. Huge. And also this guy right here, uh, who was a research assistant at Carnegie, Carnegie Mellon, software de developer Jane Street, who recently got hired as a research engineer at Chainlink Labs. And also four years of experience as a senior software engineer at Visa being hired by Chainlink Labs. And also, people have worked for a very long time at Charles Schwab as managing directors, product engineering managers at Meta, uh, basically for Facebook, uh, the Facebook company, being employed as site reliability and engineering managers at Chainlink Labs. So it's obvious to see where the talent is, are heading, the talent of people in tech industry, and they are all heading for Chainlink. That's all for me. Thank you so much for your time. Leave a like, subscribe if you enjoyed the video, or leave a dislike if you didn't. Now, please note that this, this is not financial or investment advice. This is only for edu educational and entertainment purposes only. This is Big Boss Crypto, the realest of the real crypto YouTubers. Have a wonderful day, everyone. Big Boss out.